But until we get to next weekend, there's a uh, huge heat here. This is record heat possible. Triple digits haven't seen hitting the century mark 100 degrees in 12 years. Have records that could fall that go back to 1953 and 1980. So that's a long time ago. One is what, 71 years and the other one's about 44 years old. That's a big deal to be able to say that we could get up to those records. That's a heavy lift since they've been standing so long. Current temperatures. Uh, I don't think it's 72 on Scarsdale. We'll check that. But 84. Let's go low 80s for the Bronx, Brooklyn, Staten Island, Queens, Manhattan, over to Hoboken, Jersey City, uh, Fort Lee, Hackensack, and Lodi. Low 80s now on Long Island. If you're in uh, Brooklyn or if you're in uh, the Bronx, all areas basically in the low 80s right now. Rain. Now, the temperature highs today. The high should be somewhere between National Weather Service has a heat advisory thinking that it should be like 95 to 104 today. 95 to 104. That means you have to limit your outdoor activities. That means you have to hydrate when you're outside. It means you have to take your pets on a very short walk. They don't they don't sweat like us. I mean, you're, Byron, you're supposed to say perspire fine. Uh, they, OK, they don't perspire like us. However, when they start pan, that means get those dogs inside. They don't need to be out today. It's just going to be too hot. There's there's a chance of rain this week, but only an isolated chance of a thunderstorm. You see right to the north and west of it. There's a little thunderstorm popping there that that's not going to provide relief from the heat. And it says here that at 830 we have a chance of a thunderstorm. We do. The window is between three to about eight o'clock, 830 tonight of seeing an isolated thunderstorm. And that will be torrential in nature. That means buckets of rain will hit you and it'll cool you off for a minute. But within 45 minutes after that, you're going to still feel hot and muggy because it's going to stay hot and muggy. And there's no difference here today and tomorrow. It's the same thing. A chance of a thunderstorm between 3 to about 8 p.m. But the feel like temperature will be the focus. 95 to 104 tomorrow as well. It says basically 99 for the Bronx, Brooklyn, Staten Island, Queens, Manhattan, over to New Jersey from uh, from let's say Fort Lee into Edgewater. Again, you have to take it easy today and tomorrow and Wednesday. Shorts and T-shirt, hydrate, get in the AC as much as you can. Tuesday, there's no difference here. A chance of a thunderstorm, but the main focus, and that's not the chance of that thunderstorm, it's the feel like temperature. Now, this is showing 105 degrees possible for the city. I'll say this to you right now. Your house has to have AC. Your apartment has to have AC. Every night we go through Thursday, it's going to get hotter and hotter and hotter. And if you don't have the AC going, it'll be at least 90 degrees in your house, and you don't want to go to sleep at that temperature. It's too dangerous. Wednesday, real quickly, let me just show you. It says 97 on Wednesday. It will be 100 degrees. That's record heat possible. That's the triple digit. Not a humidity factored heat in D.C. That's an actual air temperature of 100 degrees. Guys, this is some rough temperatures, uh, rough heat, dangerous heat. But by Thursday, Friday and Saturday, then things are looking better once the front pushes through and we get winds out of Canada and then we're going to feel great. Just got to make it through Thursday. Back